Back at the goal line are Langley and Spencer waiting and uh, Jim Gallery is set to move forward. A soccer style kicker normally reaches the end zone last week. None of his kickoffs could be returned by Michigan. This one's going to come up short. Moving up as Tim Spencer takes it at about the six. Spencer now looking up the middle. The 20. Got some room over the 30. 35 and spilled on the 39 yard line and now standing run back by Tim Spencer. The offensive lineup for Ohio State. Schleister is going to have Tim Spencer and Broadnax as his running backs and Anderson Williams, great receivers in the line. They'll have everybody healthy. The man to watch, Joe Lukens, an All American at right guard. Ohio State runs from the eye. Tim Spencer will be in the tailback. Uh, Vaughn Broadnax, an outstanding blocker, is the fullback. And they give it to Spencer. First play of the big hole. Up the midfield almost. A first down perhaps to the 49-yard line. And that's Carl Mecklenburg's a good inside rusher at right tackle. The linebackers, the tacklers who lead the way, are Glenn Howard and Jim Fonhorst. And the deep secondary really tested last week by Michigan. Could get a great workout here today from Schleister. It was second down just instant. Schleister on the play action. Got all day. Schleister being chased out of the pocket. Schleister fumbles the ball and has to fall on the 45. I don't believe it. The ball was fumbled in midair. It is second down and 14. Tim Spencer has been replaced by Jimmy Gale at tailback for Ohio State. Second and 14. Schleister on the quick out. He is going over here to a Gary Williams, his top receiver. Gets the first down, or does he? Nope. But Spencer now has returned at uh, Tailback, Ohio State set up in the split backs for the first time with Anderson in motion. Great back in the pocket. Schleister with pressure. Slipped his man over the middle. He's got Williams wide open at the 35 yard line. Still it fumbles the ball, and it's going to be recovered by Minnesota. And there's the thing the Gophers have been looking for the early turnover. Jim Farnhorst, but it's at the Minnesota 34 yard line. Mike Hoynsey is in at quarterback. He's got Tony Hunter. Back now at tailback, the spectacular freshman. Hoynesy on the first down rolling. Hoynesy, plenty of time over the middle, wide open. Caught by Weckbacker around the 44 yard line. Hoynesy at quarterback. He gets Tony Hunter back at tailback. Jacobs moves back to fullback with Cooper and Weckbacker. Fine receivers. And uh, in the line, well, the tough guys to look for here on the right side Bill Humphreys and Ken Dallafiore. Outstanding it is. Over 1,400 yards already in passes. Second down and just inches Minnesota at the wrong 43. They go over the first down. And I'll tell you. Jacobs, I mean, he may not have made it. Defensively, Ohio State uses a three man line. They have a great All American in Jerome Foster, the defensive tackle, and a core of linebackers that can really hit, especially All American Marcus Merrick, who leads the tackles at an inside linebacking post. The secondary, however, is young and experienced, has been tested up and down all year. Gonna be third down, less than a yard to go. Minnesota got the first big down play. Now they go back to Jacobs to the right side, and that Ohio State line is waiting. Jacobs is pounded back hard. Ten men on the line for Ohio State. They come at the punter, but Blanchard gets it off. And it's fumbled down here again. I think Ohio State that time gets it back. Garcia Lane. Schleister went to the air on the first down of the first series. See what he does here. Schuster off his tailback. Jimmy Gale and Spencer rather, and Spencer tries the left side. You see Minnesota second down and about eight here, going to a five uh, five back defense. Ohio State sits Anderson in the slot back. They bring Gale in motion, and here's Schuster. He's got a lot of receivers on the right side. He goes down the right side, way long for Anderson around the 50 yard line. Third down and seven from the 29. Quick snap. Schuster play action. Schuster. Down the left side to Williams, way off the mark, incomplete. Has not been a good opening first quarter for Art Schleister. Off kicks field goals and punts. And he gets off a dandy spiral. Schleichting is waiting. Jack Schleichting takes it on the 28, looking for Wall on the sideline. Breaks a tackle, but then runs out of real estate around the 35. Hoynes, he has Chester Cooper, his record-breaking uh, wide receiver, set to the left side, bottom of your screen. He is looking for Cooper. Hoynes, he goes instead to the short man. Jacobs out of the backfield. Brings Weckbecker down the left. Second down play for Hoynes. Off on the flat over the head of Hunter. And they've taken out a lineman. Yeah. 
Third and ten. Hoynes. He got a wide open. open. Cooper at the 50. First down, Minnesota. First down, Minnesota. First time they've been in Ohio State territory. The 49. First down again. Hoynes. Sideline pattern incomplete. A little bit wide. Second and ten for Hoynes. Ohio State now is going to a five man line. Trying to get some rush on Hoyt. Good rush on Hoyt. He's trying to set up a screen. He does. Ohio State plays it beautifully. Jacobs is crunched right in his tracks. Cooper is the top of your screen to the right. He's the main man. Another good rush on Hoyt. Sidelines to his intercepted them. Dropped by Marcus Merrick. Frank Jacobs. Was but he was able to recover. Good rush on Blanchard. He gets off a twisting kick. Going to hit in front of Garcia, and there'll be no return. Ball's rolling toward the 20. 19. Going to be dealt, killed right there for Ohio State and the White and Minnesota. Schleister has Spencer and Broadnax behind. Here's Schleister on the quick drop. Sidelines to Williams. A great oh. catch in the 40, uh, 35 yard line. Stop short of the 40 by Ohio State. But going there as he gets to the fullback and back to the right side comes Broadnax driving hard to the 45. Vaughn Broadnax. Since then. Schleister on the pitch back to tailback. Spencer caught behind the line and thrown. Audible by Schleister. There's Schleister. Play action. Rush by Schleister. Sidelines. Caught over there by Jimison, I think. And is it going to be ruled? Yep, he caught it. It's close to a first down. First down of the Buckeyes is just short of midfield, the 48 yard line. First and 10. And they give it to Spencer. Up the field to daylight to Minnesota territory inside the 45. He goes to all the Big Ten is shedding that image of four yards of the cloud of dust. Give this to Gale. Breaking clear. Gale might go. He's inside the 15, the 10, cut from behind and down by Rick Willis, saving the touchdown at first and goal, Ohio State. And as Ohio State threatens now, first and goal inside the nine yard line. Sleeps giving inside to Gale, who's stacked up in the middle by the Minnesota line. Gonna have to get Sleeser to the outside here. Let him roll on, give him the option to run pass. Now well, here he comes off the play action. Schleister end zone. It is touchdown caught by the tight end John Frank. John Frank the tight end all the way open and you heard our man Terry Hanratty call the play a roll out by Schleister and it worked Terry for the TD for the tight end spot. Bob Atha in for the point after puts it through perfectly and Ohio State has drawn first blood in this Big Ten game. So the score with five and a half minutes to go in the first quarter is now Ohio State seven and Minnesota nothing. Excellent field position here on the 45 yard line. That aspect which has troubled Joe Salem has turned around a bit today although Ohio State leads the game seven nothing. Points he with the field position on the screen. Oh the middle hits tickets. Now he's got blockers 50 45 into Ohio State territory first down to 43. Anthony Griggs made the stop for Ohio State. He's a transfer from Villanova. Now Minnesota here's a quick handoff to Jacobs from the inside the fullback. Second down and seven for Minnesota. Hoinsey with time. Hoinsey going got to the sidelines for Cooper. He's got it inside the five. First and goal Minnesota as Hoinsey hits his favorite target. Now let's get Hoinsey out to the right. For Minnesota. Strout and motion. Hoinsey on the flip to Jacobs trying to cut back and he's going to be thrown for a loss. Boy Ohio State's defense. Second and goal Minnesota at the Ohio State six. Cooper is wide to the left. They give it again to Strout. Strout tries the left side doesn't get much. Big play here for Joe Salem's team. Third and goal at the five. Cooper's on the left. Davidson to the right. Hoinsey play action. Hoinsey got some room. Hoinsey looking for the end zone. He fires end zone. It is incomplete. Hoinsey trying to drill it right through the defenders of Ohio State. Credit Ohio State's tremendous goal line stand defensively. They stop him for a minus one on three plays. Here's the field goal kick and it is no good. Wide to the left. Gallery has missed. Ohio State will get the ball at the 20. Nice 10 out of 18. Here's Schleister, play action bootlegging. Schleister's going to run. Schleister has chased out of bounds around the 26 yard line. May have been going out of bounds, stop the clock with four seconds to go. So this will be the final play of this quarter. Here's kind of a delayed draw up the middle. Here comes Watch Spencer out. to the fullback. Got some room. Spencer and a leg race now with Wittes, and he's going to win it. Spencer all the way for a touchdown. He goes. 73 yards and Ohio State has exploded and that could really be psychologically a killing blow against Minnesota. Snap. 
And Athos got it. And there's the 14 point spread by Ohio State as the first quarter comes to an end here at Memorial Stadium in Minnesota. That ended the first period. And now the kickoff will start quarter number two. Eighth of kicking off. Back deep are Kerry Glenn and Manny Henry. Ball is going toward Kerry Glenn. Backing up the end zone. He'll not bring this one out. It's kicked beyond the end line. But Hoynes, he does now down by 14. The quick one off the side to Cooper. He snares it, and he's going to make about eight or nine yards out of it. See what Hoynes, he wants to do here on second and one. Sometimes the quarterback will get cute here and fake a run going for the long bomb. He's down by 14 points. Not even a fake. Hoynes going for the long one down the middle is Cooper here's Cooper there and it is broken up and uh, Cooper tried to grab it through here today for the Big Ten now it is third and one and the give is to Jacobs and he plunges for the first down if the play goes the flying judge is Gil Marksman field judge is Bob Colburn and first and ten Minnesota Points here over the middle, nice. wide oh. open, and it is caught by Nick Davidson. Over the middle, fumbles the ball, and let's see. I think Ohio State man was there first, but he didn't get the ball. Wow, Davidson was down in Ohio State territory. Had the ball jarred loose, but Minnesota gets it back. And all of a sudden, you're going to see Cooper run that little out and up, you know, for a big touch. Tony Hunter back in the lineup for Minnesota. And here's the pitch to Hunter. First time he's run the ball today. Hunter, great speed, turning outside over the 50. Into Ohio State to the 47. Hoinsey taking a good look here at the Ohio State defense. Cooper is to the right, left is Weckbecker. Second half play by Hoinsey. Good blitz up the middle. Oh, oh, wide open. Cooper wide open. Lost his footing at the 20. He would have had a touchdown. Cooper's are threatening here, although the Buckeyes lead 14 0. Points a quick sideline pattern. Hits Weckbacker inside the 15 yard line. Mark's trying to check Mike Coins' aerial circus here. It is second down and just a foot or so to go for first down. They go for the first down up the middle. Tony Hunter inside the five. Hunter will be first and goal. It's a tough Ohio State team in this situation. And we'll see what Owens see where goes Ohio State offside. And here comes ja Jacobs driving maybe to the two. Noted any movement from uh, Minnesota. Strout now is the backfield with Jacobs. They give us to Jacobs. Jacobs dies to the left side. Penalty flag down. Offsides. Offsides Ohio State. It is first and goal at the one. Strout and Hunter now the running backs for Minnesota. Hoinsey gives it to Jacobs. Jacobs is upended and spill right at the line of scrimmage. Might have lost some footage too. Now it is second and goal. Ball to about the two. Hoinsey, Hoinsey, running right. Jacobs trying to cut back. Goes right down about the one and he stopped. Third and goal at the one yard line. Minnesota has been frustrated so far. And here's Hoinsey looking. Hoinsey fires to the end zone and it is touchdown. Caught by the tight end, Todd Hallstrom, who lined up as a tight end. He is ordinarily a guard, and Hallstrom has caught his first touchdown of the year. Margin to seven. The snap and the kick is right through there. Minnesota is back within a touchdown. So with 9.53 to go in the first half from Minneapolis, it's Ohio State 14, Minnesota 7. And he missed a short one here today. Kick by Gallery. Booms it high toward the goal line. Langley takes it at the 10 on the run. Langley gets through the first wave and his cut down. He comes over the 25. Schleister holds about every imaginable passing record at Ohio State. All but one. Makes the draw. Here's Schleister. Plenty of time. Down the sidelines. Where he's wide, wide open. open. At the 40. Takes a hit. Bounces off. Comes to the 35. Schleister's to Gary Williams. Uh, Jameson is also in there in place of Williams. So Schleister has a new set of receivers. Here comes Langley in motion. Schleister gives on the run to Gale. Gale away from one tackler. Right in the arms of a couple of more. And 30 yards. He came in here with 18-11, so he's having a big day. And now he gives a deep handoff to the tailback, Spencer. Spencer stops short of the 30. Gale and Broadnax now the split back behind Schleister. Here comes the option play. Schleister's going to keep. He's got the first down, 25 oh. 20. They go all the way. Schleister comes back at the 10, and he is stopped inside the five. 
What a brilliant leader Art Schleister is. Tailback is Jimmy Gale here, and this is Williams in motion. They give it to fake to Gale. Schleister, Schleister running out of the passing formation, taken out of bounds inside the three. Second and goal, about two and a half yards for Ohio State. Williams in motion. Now they give it to Spencer over the top for touchdown. He goes. Spencer dives and he penetrates the goal line, although he was pounded back. A headlinesman had it marked. It's another six points for Ohio State, and the Buckeyes go up 20 to 7. Oh, by Tom Zach and the kick by Atha. And Atha three for three, a perfect day, and it becomes a 14 point lead once more. Seven minutes and 39 seconds to go in the first half. Bob Atha kicks off. Glenn, uh, Kerry Glenn and Manny Henry waiting for Minnesota to go to the end zone, gets through Henry and out. Points he has Weckbacker to the right, and to the left is Cooper. First down pass. Orangey over the middle of the screen to Jacobs. Breaks one tackle at the 20. He's going to get up maybe a yard. That's about it. Second and nine here for Hoynsey. Protect well this time. A little throw. short one to Jacobs out of the backfield. Jacobs breaks it up to about the 27. Looked like both guys were open to me, Terry. He wanted to go the deep man and was there. Here's the pitch to Hunter. Sweeping wide right. Got the first down. He dies to the 32. Now first and 10 with six minutes to go in the first half. Over the middle. He's got his man, Weckbacker. That'll be a first down. Ohio State leads 14 7. Now five and a half minutes to go in the first half. Here comes, the Here comes the blitz. Hoins, he rolls away from it. Got a man open. Throws short to Weckbacker. A couple of more defensive backs come on for Ohio State. Mark Eberts and Roland Tatum. As Ohio State looks for the pass here on second and 10. Hornsey over the middle. He's connected again. That is hit Fumble. Justin Cooper. Fumble of the ball, and Minnesota's oh. got it at the 46. Our fullbacks. Unbalanced line to the left side. Two tight ends for Minnesota. They give it to Jacobs. Jacobs diving, and I think he has it. Walter Ross now has come in the lineup for Minnesota. Only Jacobs the running back. Hornsey. Maybe he can run. Hornsey diving to get out of bounds around the 45. Well, Game on that play at second down and ten. They run the draw play to Jacobs. Ohio State not fooled. Cobb was right there to make the stop. One Hoinsey has his chief receiver out the wide side of the field to the right. That's Chester Cooper. One more pass for second to tie the record. Here are the everybody coming. Hoinsey going deep for Cooper. Cooper running can't get it. All out blitz. We're back now for the start of the second half of today's Big Ten game. Ohio State, number one team in the Big Ten standings, 21, University of Minnesota, 7. Minnesota with uh, two other scoring opportunities in the first half were shut down by Ohio State's very rugged, short yardage defense. Bob Atha, number one, will kick off for Ohio State. Waiting deep are Kerry Glenn and Manny Henry for the University of Minnesota. And here we go. Second half is underway, going deep in the end zone. Taken back there by Kerry Glenn, who has to drop on it in the end zone for the touchback. One setback, first play. Here's Hoynsey. Out of the backfield to Jacobs. Over the 20, he's going to get a short game, maybe four yards up. DeAndrea, Merrick, Cobb, and Griggs are the linebackers. Ohio State, tough on the run, 3 4. Three man rush. Hoynsey, plenty of time, drills it hard, and is intercepted. Ohio State at the 40 yard line, intended for Cooper. And it's picked off, and Ohio State has come up with a quick turnover here to start the third period. John Frank has a touchdown pass here. Here's a quick screen to Atha. He's going to throw. He fakes on it, and he's driven out of bounds. I think they want an Atha to go deep to Williams. Because you have to get these people reacting to different things. Jimmy Gale, the tailback, is in there, and he runs right into the arms here of a Minnesota defender, Todd Peterson. Third down for Ohio State. Sleeves to try to make the turnover payoff. Fires over the middle and oh. hits a defender in the shoulder. Intended there by William. They'll try a 53 yard try. Atha, who's kicked one from 57 yards, and here's his try from 53. Might have the distance, and it is wide. He was long enough, but to the left. And so the field goal misses. The ball goes over on the field goal try, which is the 36 yard line. Hoinsey to Jacobs, runs into his own man and recovers nicely. Takes it up over the 40. The <laughs> Ho 
Boynsey drills it and dropped by Jacobs at the 45. Now they've got to get four yards here or it'll be punting time. As they send five, blitzing the outside man, wide open is Cooper, takes it for a first down over the 50 to the Ohio State 49. Seven catches in the first half, he passed the all-time record, that was his eight. Over the middle, a little short when he's held the backfield to Jacobs, penalty flag, however, is thrown. Up interference against Ohio State. He's lost only three. First down pass by Horns. Boy, look at him stand in there and he's sacked. Taken now for the first time. It's third down and nine now at the 48 yard line. So now Hoynes needs a big play. A moment ago he had second and one. Big defensive play that was by Ohio State. Here's Hoynes firing to the sideline. Oh. He's got Cooper. First down inside the 35. Been purely a passing attack today on Minnesota. Ohio State all but shut down Minnesota's rush. Quick one is thrown behind Davidson. So lots of time left in this football game. He's so far 25 out of 41. Wow, he's had a big day. And Cooper's back in there now on the left side. Here's Hornsey. Hornsey down the middle. Intended for the tight end Carroll. Earl Bruce has pulled out some linemen, put in extra defensive backs here against the threat of Hornsey, who's had a great uh, day passing for Minnesota. And now third and ten. Here's Hornsey. Ball is tipped and almost picked off. Incomplete. Cooper, the big man's being double covered on the right side. And here's Hoynes. Blitz the outside, fires it is caught by Cooper inside the 15. Stopped by Gale, but Cooper. First down, new life for the Gophers who trail by 14 points, but now threatening here inside the 15 yard line of Ohio State. Hoynes throwing on just about every down, rolling. Hoynes eludes one man. Hoynes picks over the field. Hoynes fires the end zone, tears, broken up. Oh, at the last moment, or it would have been a score if he had any success anyway. <laughs> Offensive interference. That's loss of down to at the bottom. Stay play, Stay play. And Hoynes. Hoynes. Hoynes firing at ball for Carroll, and it is touchdown. Touchdown, Minnesota. Jake Carroll, the tight end, a great catch. I'll tell you what, you pay the price because that cement is real close to the field down there. All right. Brilliant catch by Carroll. The seven. The kick is up, and he's got it. And we got a different ball game now. Third period, 11.25 to go. The score now is Michigan 21, or Ohio State 21, Minnesota 14. <laughs> and a half minutes. Well, a beautiful touchdown pass it was to Jay Carroll. Booming kick by Galloway. Rise Ohio State way back. Better get on that hits. ball. Yep, that's a free ball. As <laughs> they kill back there. Oh, it's Tim Spencer tailback. Vaughn Broadnax a fullback. Anderson and Williams the wide receivers. They give it to Broadnax a fullback and he is pulled in after just a short game. Schleister fakes the fullback, runs the option, tries to cut back and he's taken down hard. Mike Robb. Here's Schleister, third and seven. Schleister tipped, incomplete. Punted in the first half was a pretty short one. But this one uh, is off the side of his foot. And Schleichty lets the ball hit. It might have been a mistake. It's going to roll dead around the 44-yard line of Minnesota. And it is illegal use of the hands. If Minnesota wants to, they can call for another punt. There's Here they come, though. Yep. Now they stay away from Atha, the kick, and this time Schlichten's got it to 45 in Ohio State territory. Breaks a tackle, still on his feet. 36 yard line, goes Schlichting. Hunter and Jacobs, the running backs behind Hoynsey, but he is throwing. And Hoynsey goes Watch to out. the sidelines. Cooper, incomplete. Hoynsey just going up every day. They got single cover. Now they're going double coverage on Cooper. Second and 10 for Hoynsey. Over the middle to Jacobs. He calls on at the 30. Everybody looking for the pass. And this looks like the blitz. Here it comes. Yep. Pretty good protection. Off in the flat. It goes to Jacobs at the 20. He's got the first down inside the 20 yard line. Inside the 20 yard line. First down to Ohio State 18 yard line. One running back back there. But it's the going to Blitzing from behind. Hoynes right there. Gives Perfect. it to Jacobs at the 10. He will score. Oh. Touchdown. 
And when you have an all-out blitz, there's nobody covering your running backs. And that's what happened to Jacobs that time. Waiting for the snap. Up they go for the kick. And it's all locked up. Brand new game in Minneapolis. Ohio State 21, Minnesota 21. And we still have 8 minutes, 34 seconds to go in the third quarter. Until Blanchard really hit that one. Now Schleister with Tim Spencer tailback gives it to Spencer. Got a hole, tries to cut and slips. Schleister. Schleister under pressure. Hits his tight end. That is Frank into Minnesota territory. On the John Frank made that uh, catch having an outstanding year now with 30 catches on the season. Here's a deep hand off the tailback Spencer and he's fighting hard and it is second and seven. Schleister play action. Play. Schleister drills a little short one to the uh, tight end. Frank he's going to be stopped around the 35. 21. There's the signal. It's now tied at 21 but Ohio State knocking near the Minnesota 21. Give inside the broad knock. Oh. Breaks the tackle still going inside the 10. Can't bring him down. That's a throwback to those old Woody Hayes days. Now here's a crack inside again by Broadnax. Second down for Ohio State and goal to go from the seven. Here comes the audible. And it's Schleister going to the goal line incomplete. Intended for Williams. Here's Schleister. Schleister now. Schleister from behind. In zone broken up. And oh interference. no! Interference called against Kerry Glenn of Minnesota. Gale's the tailback, and they give it to Gale, and he is cut down to one. And second and goal. Let's see if he tries to go up over the top. Less than a minute to go in the third period. Quarterback sneaks Schleister for the touchdown. Schleister dives in and scores for Ohio State. And the Buckeyes have regained the lead at 27 to 21 with exactly 30 seconds remaining in the third period. Wow, three for three today. The kick is up and through, and Ohio State is back to a seven point lead with 30 seconds remaining in the third period. Ohio State 28 and Minnesota with 10 minutes and 10 seconds to go in the game. Lots of time. Points he hands off inside to Henry and the freshman fullback. Three wide receivers are now in the Minnesota lineup. Cooper is to your left. Fumble. Minnesota, oh Ohio State recovers. Ohio State has covered the fumble by Mike Hoinsey on the snap. Broadnax has played all the way at fullback just as Schleister has gone. Here's the play action fake by Schleister. Over the middle to his tight end. Oh. Frank and he hangs on inside the 20. John Frank. Second down call. Here's the pitch outside to Spencer going wide and he is taken out of bounds around the 14 yard line. Schleister has Anderson way wide the left and he sends Williams in motion. Schleister rolling the strong side. Schleister fires and it is broken up at the six yard line. Mike Tomzak, who's the heir apparent to Art Schleister, freshman quarterback from Calumet City, Illinois, number 15 is home. Here's the ball there. The kick is way through there. Good by Atha. So Atha has given Ohio State a little cushion and insurance, and the lead goes to 10 points. He has reached the end zone with about every kick. Glenn and Henry are waiting. And this is not a good kick, and it's going to be taken by an up back around the 28, 25 yard line. And Minnesota will get it about past the 30 yard line. Although no contract's been signed, certainly for the University of Minnesota. Manny Henry's in there. Here's Watch out. being charged. Now he gets off the screen to Henry. Manny Henry with blockers at the 40. Manny Henry at the 42. First down, perhaps. About a 10 yard gain. Mike Hoinsey, who's had a record day passing for the University of Minnesota. Here's Hoinsey looking. Hoinsey over the middle. Open Cooper. Inside the 40 and spun down the 37. First down for Minnesota. Now they're down in Ohio State territory with 7.35 to go. There's still time for Minnesota. Hoinsey's got to connect. There's the blitz. Sideline's got his man. Rick Becker inside the 20. Out of bounds of the 18-yard line. Minnesota has come back with resilience throughout this game. Hoinsey drop. Hoinsey firing to Cooper. That's knocked down beautifully at the last moment by Kelvin Bell. 
Second and ten for Hoensey. Look for the pass. Hoensey down the middle and it is touchdown to Carroll. Oh, second touchdown of the game for Jay Carroll. Another one for Hoensey. And Minnesota's not out of this thing yet. The two set it up to win it with a field goal. Kick is good. The lead is down to the field goal margins. 68 yards in just a minute 20, and we have 6.56 to go in the game. Sleister has to go back to work. Play action by Sleister. Sleister has to fire it. It is caught on the screen. It is Spencer. Spencer for 25 and haul down the 26 yard line. Second and four, and the give is to Spencer, and he stopped cold. It's two out of 14. Yeah, and look at Minnesota. Eight out of 17, which is just spectacular. Big play here for Schleister and he pitches out the outside to Spencer and he's got the first down. He goes out of bounds stopping the clock but first down play for Schleister. Goes to run he up the time. Pitches that ball back to Gale and Gale runs right in the arms of Glenn says let it. Schleister faking looking Schleister fires the sidelines for Anderson incomplete. Over his head. Third and nine and a half for Ohio State. Minnesota trailing by three. And Schleister looking. And there's a sack. Schleister taken down by Fred Orgus at the 16 yard line. Minnesota expects good field position now. Here's the snap. They get it away. High kick. Fair yep. catch call for, but Schleister's going to let it hit. Takes a Minnesota bounce. And Ohio State touches it down at the 40. Everybody knows he's going to throw. Points with the rush. Goes the screen. the screen to Henry. Manny Henry at the 40, 35, stays on his feet to the 32. About an eight yard gain. To a second down and two for Minnesota. They run the play up the middle. Henry first down inside the 30. 28 yards to go for Minnesota. The blitz. blitz. Yep. Points. Got to get rid of it. There he goes. Got a man open. Incomplete. The blitz did the job that time. Minnesota blitz by Ohio State again. Hoinsey, well, Hoinsey fires and it is incomplete. Trying to hit Hunter. The blitz again. Yep, there they come. All out blitz. Hoinsey running. Hoinsey fires. He's got a man down there and it is. Touchdown. Touchdown. Touchdown to Carroll. Minnesota leads. First time in the game. Like I said, Jim, you live with the blitz, you die with it. Man to man coverage downfield. I love to play against blitzing teams. The third touchdown reception by Jay Carroll, a sophomore, and they're celebrating in Winona, Minnesota, all week over that. And just let's fly. Now you're going to see the tip. I mean, it's, they all count the same, guys. But great concentration there by Carroll. Jim Gallery, and now this uh, be a big uh, point here. Ohio State could settle for a tie, but now we'll take a touchdown to do it for the Buckeyes. That gives uh, Minnesota a four point lead at 35 31 with two minutes and 38 seconds to go. It's the first time in the game that his team has trailed. Forget about the run. Yep. He has got Williams to the right and Anderson to the left. And Ohio State needs a field goal. I mean, a touchdown. A field goal will not do it. And there's Anderson making the catch around the 50, cutting back to the 45 43. Big play. Schleister to Anderson. There's Schleister over the middle, broken up, almost intercepted. Intended for Williams, this time over 30 passes a game average. Here's Schleister again, sideline pattern, incomplete. Intended for Anderson, Tim Spencer the tailback. Here's Schleister. Schleister over the middle, and it is incomplete. Almost a great catch. Yeah, Thad Jemison that was, or was it the, yeah, Thad Jemison. They're trailing by four, two minutes, nine seconds to go, fourth down and ten. And here is Schleister over the middle and intercepted. It is intercepted. Minnesota takes the ball at the 30. He should have blocked it down, but Kerry Glenn has the ball. And so much for the little items. Arch Schleister dejected, you know, because he's such a thoroughbred. I doubt he'll go to the air, though. Danny Henry, good open up the middle. Henry comes for about five yards to the 30. So Ohio State will be tackling the ball, trying to force a turnover. It's second down and five for Minnesota. 
They hand up the middle to Bob Straup, and he is hammered back. He, yep, personal foul against Ohio State. That's going to cost the Buckeyes. That may be the game. But it will appear now with 59 seconds to go that Ohio State is going to become the last team that had just one loss. Hoinsey on top of the ball. Used its final timeout. There's the drop down by Hoinsey. Now this time the clock will roll. Uh, happy Mike Hoinsey will take his last snap. And there it is. That'll do it for Minnesota. They'll upset the Ohio State Buckeyes. A stunning upset today in Minneapolis. 3-2. Here's the count off. And that's it. Now listen to the happiness coming erupting and the noise from the stadium floor and the stands here. The Gophers trail by 14 points at halftime. They roared back in the second half behind the strong right arm of Mike Hoinsey. Joe Salem over to shake hands and get the congratulations from both uh, Coach Earl Bruce and Art.